Iraq's plunged into political turmoil as two major parties suspend their participation in Parliament after 12 Sunnis were found killed. One senior Sunni MP warned the government of dire consequences. We warn against those who will try to conceal the perpetrators of this heinous crime, because this will be considered to many as a message that the crime happened with the knowledge of the government, opening the gate to a full-blown sectarian war that will never end. The United Nations assistance mission in Iraq also responded, with Special Representative Nikolai Madlinov issuing a statement saying, I call upon all law enforcement agencies to work quickly in order to bring those responsible to justice. Whilst there's no indication who might be responsible for the murders of the 12, it has sent shockwaves through Baghdad. It's alleged the men were kidnapped by militia at a checkpoint in Baghdad and taken to an undisclosed location. One MP was then released, badly beaten with a broken leg. Twelve bodies were then found in three separate locations across the capital. The government says it's launched an investigation, but with sectarian tensions running high and already blame being placed on a Shia militia for the murders, that will do little to placate the Sunnis. Imran Khan, Al Jazeera, Baghdad.